New at six tonight. This week, the Central Missouri Humane Society introduced a new tool to get more dogs into good homes. And the shelter is already dealing with a large intake of animals this summer. ABC 17's Morgan Burris joins us live in studio. Morgan, you're told the summer is always a busy time at the shelter. Yeah, Megan Lucas, the Central Missouri Humane Society is dealing with an increase in intakes and an increased length of stay for many of their pets. This week, they introduced a new priority pause list in an attempt to get out at-risk animals into homes and out of the shelter. It's really just to let people know that these are pets that aren't doing well at the shelter. It still doesn't mean that they have a time limit, but these are pets that are more challenging to place. The priority pause list is a list of dogs at the shelter dealing with kennel stress or certain behavioral issues. Their adoption fees have been waived to get them adopted quicker. We are struggling with space issues, and so therefore we're offering quite a few adoption specials. Casey says the shelter is seeing many owners trying to rehome their pets. And while there is still kennel space, it's nearing capacity. Now, it's not just dogs being brought into the shelter this summer. There are also lots of kittens. We're in what's known as kitten season right now, where more kittens are being brought in and therefore being brought into the shelter. And that includes these four guys that you see here playing behind me. This comes as the Central Missouri Humane Society is still fundraising toward its new location to be built on Brown School Road. Casey says that new location will bring more space and more resources. Casey tells me they're currently still in the planning and zoning stage with that new property. She's hoping they can start using the land this fall. Thank you, Morgan. We also reached out to the Jefferson City Animal Shelter today. Captain David Williams says that shelter is at capacity for both dogs and cats.